Hey there, Wondering Watchers. I'm Sony Golden for The Vibe is Golden. Welcome to this special titillating edition of Tabloid Tarot, which unveils celebrity secrets in love dating and super coupling. In today's titillating Tabloid Tarot, we're taking a peek at the reported tensions between two famous exes. We are tossing Britney Spears and Justin Timberlake into the spotlight to be Tabloid Tarot. So let's see what sensational headline we have for Britney and Justin. We have daydream, optimism, illusion, and is that detour. We also have daydream again. You have the spectral knight and this card of fear expecting the worst afraid of failure wasting time on negative thoughts so here it's almost as if this daydreams these daydreams and the fear and negative thoughts um it's almost as if they are fearing the worst about uh kind of what the other person is implying or saying about them. Um, and here with this spectral knight, um, this card kind of indicates that uh, a need to kind of like, uh, well, that people are protected, that they are protected from um, other people's opinions and gossip and a sense of like not letting other you know like dramas hurt them so here it's it's as if they need to kind of um recognize that what's being said or implied is not necessarily um kind of indicating that it's about the other person um but it seems to kind of they're expecting that that's what's happening so let's explore the titillating tidbits of this celebrity beef between Justin and Brittany. So I'm going to go ahead and lay out the cards and then go through the positions and their meanings. So the page of pentacles at the bottom of the deck is kind of making me think about the fact that they were uh, in a relationship learning about love, learning about uh, self-esteem and kind of kind of like students of love at the time. So here, in terms of the current connection, we have the High Priestess, Brittany's beef with JT. We have the Knight of Pentacles. In terms of the source of their conflict, we have Temperance. In terms of Justin's beef with Brittany, we have the Empress. Um, the past that Brittany is holding on to, we have the Three of Pentacles. The past that Justin is holding on to, we have the Lovers. In terms of how this impacts the future in terms of Brittany, um, we have the Page of Swords. And for Justin, we have the Chariot. So significant uh, in terms of the major arcana cards that come up. So the major arcana cards being indicative of like learning life lessons. Um, and with this page of pentacles here, it's almost a sense that a lot of what's going on between Brittany and Justin is this, the concepts of like learning significant life lessons and just not necessarily knowing um, what to do in terms of like the aspects of uh, sharing that. Um, and kind of like that's now led to this place of kind of just fantasizing or kind of thinking about possibly what could have been 
what was maybe even reshaping, um, you know, things that were said and having more intensity or uh, more significance. But with the high priestess being their current connection, um, it's a sense of things like really being passive and hidden. Um, again, that concept of like really not talking to other people about or each other about things, but kind of um, just keeping things to themselves and feeling like they know exactly what was going on or, you know, they know what the other person is thinking um, or insinuating. But here with these daydreams, um, like illusions and fears and stuff, it may be that they're not necessarily, um, when it comes to each other and this concept of just like being students of love, it's almost as if they their t intuition when it comes to each other maybe just wasn't well developed. Um, in terms of Brittany's beef with JT with the the Knight of Pentacles, it could be that she felt he was um, too focused on making his future um, and kind of doing kind of doing what he needed to do to make sure his future was kind of set for himself. Um, and in terms of Justin's beef with Brittany with this Empress card, um, it's almost as if like he is, he's taking an issue with how much like sexual attention she was getting, um, how much her sexuality was a part of her identity uh whether it was something that you know other people kind of wrote the script for her to do or uh her embracing that herself um but just the fact that like she was uh kind of recognized that she was this attractive beautiful sensation and almost feels like she, she used her uh her um kind of sensuality and sexuality possibly against him or to kind of um distract him maybe even to manipulate him the source of conflict between them with this temperance card um this is a card of peace healing um kind of negotiating extremes and finding the middle road so i feel like they just never really were able to get a sense of um clear like balance of who they were and kind of recognize that uh you know he wasn't just someone who was um concerned about his future and you know his standing in life and how he looked in the future and she wasn't just a sex symbol who was using that to her advantage and kind of like actually figuring out um the truth of things um so they kind of just tech took certain aspects um of those extremes and just like held on to them and kind of let that guide their their judgment or their better you know guide in a way where they're more daydreaming and kind of thinking the worst of things um but in terms of the past that Brittany's holding on to with the three of pentacles she may be holding on to this concept of like um almost like bringing you know, like helping justin achieve a certain amount of uh recognition and success um, another part of me kind of is thinking about that aspect of her saying she got pregnant with Justin and um, that he wasn't ready, so she had an abortion. Um, and like kind of holding on to that aspect of it. But for Justin, he's holding on to this concept of like the lovers. Um, so to me, it's almost as if Justin, it 
is really kind of holding on to this concept of young love and um, tr like wanting a future for them, despite her thinking that maybe he was focused on himself. Um, it's almost as if he did have a plan for the future, but it included her um, at some point down the line, possibly um, being the mother of his kids. But it's almost a sense of like her kind of, um, his beef with her being the empress is more kind of wanting that, um, the attention and wanting to be able to um, express herself and um, kind of do what she wanted and have her fun and like uh, more focused on herself as opposed to the potential connection in the long term. So in terms of the impact for the future here, um, here with this three of pentacles in the past that Brittany is holding on to, it's impacting her future connection with um, Justin with this page of swords. And this is a card of like uh, the spy, the gossip, kind of, I you know, gathering all the information and using it um, the way it's like a, it's kind of like an immature, naive energy that I get from this card in particular, like just kind of having a sword and like flinging it around, not necessarily caring who gets hurt from it um, and kind of holding on to this aspect of what was initially as opposed to like what could be or like like kind of just holding on to um, the knowledge that she has and how she looked at it as opposed to a more mature, thoughtful analysis, logical aspect, but really just trying to take the information known and kind of apply it however it can be applied. In terms of Justin and how him holding on this to this concept of the lovers impacts his um impacts the future connection for him we have here the chariot and this is very much reminds me of the spectral knight of like trying to um you know maneuver around drama and conflict and kind of work those opposing forces in a way where um where he is still advancing and moving forward and becoming victorious. Um, definitely, there there is this uh, determination, very similar to the Knight of Pentacles, which is Brittany's beef with Justin. Um, this sense of, you can even see these cars uh, in these two cards, um, a sense of like really intentionally making each step because of the goals in the future. So it seems like he's wanting to do that. He's looking at things from a very, um, what could be like the potential, what can be um, aspects of things. But it, it seems like um, there's a more, for Brittany, more holding on to initial stages of things, initial phases as opposed to really um kind of see learning from things entirely but that's what i have for you between justin and Brittany in terms of their beef thanks for watching this titillating edition of tabloid tarot we'll see you next time take care